The following segment is brought to you by Intermountain Healthcare and the Utah Department of Health. There's presents to buy, you know, on certain deadlines. If you're mailing them, you need to time that out. There's often a pressure that we probably put on ourselves to get the perfect gift. The holidays are upon us, and for many, that means added stress. This year, the stress could look a little different because of the coronavirus pandemic. You know, and the holidays are a great time for tradition and getting together, and so... People now have to think that out. Is this worth the risk? Is it worth the risk for some family members who maybe we think are healthier or not? One way to manage your stress and mental health is to create a looser schedule. When we have open time and we're not necessarily doing as well, uh, the mind tends to kind of fixate on what might not be going well or on our worries. You can also keep a gratitude journal. Before going to bed each night for two weeks, you write down three things you're grateful for. Now, one of the keys here is you do want this to be different from day to day if you can. This holiday season, create new traditions. One way to help with that is children love to receive mail. So if you are a grandparent, you could, you know, send regular or just, you know, once in a while notes. And remember to look at the big picture and know that this is only one holiday season. Mary Nichols for Check Your Health.